back to Theme Park Wizard here, and today I'm going to go over the top five best rides, in my personal opinion, at Disney's Animal Kingdom at Walt Disney World in Florida. Uh, obviously, the parks are closed right now, but when they reopen, I'll be hoping to get all these five rides uh, immediately. And, um,. Yeah, so basically, let's go ahead and let's get started on this beautiful park. First of all, actually, I actually just want to say, <laughs> this park is so beautiful. It's one of my, it's my favorite Disney World park, really, because I love the earth, love animals, and I love how it's so big, and it's it's really immersive, and um, I love this park's theming. So, with that, let's get to number five. Number five is the Navi River Jack. Um, I like this ride because, again, <laughs> immersiveness, I like the animal shamans, the shaman is like massive, but at the same time, it's, you know, just a boat ride, it's kind of slow, there's no really thrilling elements, but it is very pretty, everything inside of the attraction is just very pretty to look at, so, it, in that respect, it's, it's a good attraction and really immersive, and it's a nice, nice ride for everyone, but it really has a very long wait time because again not many attractions at Animal Kingdom despite how big it is and I definitely want, really wouldn't want to wait more than 30 minutes for this even though the wait time is usually hours long so because of that I usually don't uh, go on this attraction very much and going on next let's go to number four which is Dinosaur Dinosaur, in my opinion, well, it's the same system, same ride system, enhanced motion vehicles, as Indiana Jones Adventure at Disneyland. And because I'm a Disney, I'm at closer to Disneyland, I've been on Indiana Jones countless numbers of times. Indiana Jones is just so much better than Dinosaur in every aspect of the um, of the word that I, there's just no way Dinosaur could be in the uh like top three i'd put dinosaur even like farther back but again there's not very many attractions in um uh animal kingdom so that's why dinosaur was able actually to make the top five list it's certainly better than primeval world and uh i like Kelly river rapids but um dinosaur is better than that attraction in my opinion and also the fact that I love dinosaurs. I love at the Universal Parks. I love Jurassic World or the Jurassic Park rides. So I love dinosaurs and I love the Jurassic Park movies. So <laughs> any dinosaur themed ride, I'm definitely gonna like. But Indiana yeah, Jones certainly better. Moving on to number three, Kilimanjaro Safari. Kilimanjaro Safari is um wow. It, it's definitely the longest ride at um the park. But it's like super, it's really good. It's great for the whole family. I'd wait hours for this attraction um, if I had to. It's like it's like the Studio 2 at Universal's, but with animals. It's fantastic. You go through safaris, but then there's a, these, you go know, over bridges, and it's really like you're in Africa going through, because um, it's in the Africa, uh, it's, it's either in Africa or Asia, the, um, the pavilion or the land, but. I think it's Africa actually, but you're, it's like you're really going through Africa, but, and it's really, really cool, and it's really, it's one of my, my, it's one of my, definitely the top three, I'd say, for a while it was my favorite Animal Kingdom, but the other two definitely went above and beyond, in my opinion, so, I got pushed back to number three, but it's something, it's definitely a must do when I head over to Animal Kingdom, because I really love animals, like I previously mentioned, and, um, I like, it's a nice long attraction, so, it is, worth the wait if you're waiting like two hours for it. Moving on to number two, <laughs> we have one of Disney World's mountains, in fact, the tallest Disney mountain and tallest artificial mountain in the world, Expedition Everest. Expedition Everest obviously was um, inspired by the Matterhorn. Um, well, Walt Disney and Frank Wells, they all look climbing mountains they've all they're all all about adventures and like uh, all about climbing at uh, mountainous and you know the yetis and the, the all the mythical creatures and that you know had stories of the mountains so expedition of everest embodies that they took the madhorn concept in 
really just expanded on it it's big time and they put um made it with um uh, mount everest to the manhorn mountain and they since everest is the tallest mountain in the world or one of the tallest mountains in the world they made the attraction just as big and it's really awesome i like how it was disney's first backwards attraction i like how you go um, you go forwards and backwards inside the mountain there's the with the disco yeti that's unfortunate it was good when it uh premiered but of course now stuck in b mode hopefully they get to fixing that as a uh, really adds to the end of the attraction i love how it's more a little bit more thrilling than that one and uh faster and it's just basically like a modern version of the Matterhorn, and it's really awesome. And I love the Matterhorn; it's such a classic. Now, Expedition Everest is a classic and really an icon. With the Tree of Life, it's an icon for um, Animal Kingdom. And drum roll, pre please. Here comes the number one best attraction at Animal Kingdom, and I'm sure you've all guessed it already when you started watching this video. I think it's a pretty unanimous decision: a Flight of Passage. Flight of Passage is one of the most amazing Disney rides ever created. So beautiful. Um, people wait hours and hours upon hours upon hours for this attraction each and every day when the parks are open. And I feel like even in a post-COVID-19 world, they'll still wait hours for this attraction. It is the queue is immersive, the ride is immersive, and the seats, I mean, it's incredible. The seats. Are like they breathe with you as you um you ride the banshee it's super immersive it's a fantastic ride system and even though our um avengers e-ticket in california adventure is delayed i hope whenever we get it it is kind of like an expanded version of the flight of passage because i would love to have a flight of passage type or even better ride system here in california so i'm super excited for that and that is it that is those are my um my five top five best attractions at animal kingdom comment your list below like and subscribe like the video subscribe to the channel for more theme park updates and cool videos like this especially until the parks open when the parks open we'll have more construction updates um, come below your favorite list and if you want to help support the channel I have a buy me a coffee page the link is down below you can buy me a, uh, or really buy me a popcorn bucket <laughs> um, and uh, help out support the channel all proceeds go again towards better equipment and to making the channel much better I hope you guys are having a great day and a great time stuck in uh, staying at home and as always have a fantastic day